Hi guys, hope you're well. Um, I'm just going to spend a couple of minutes talking about um, you know, looking toned and you know, reaching that goal. It's, tone's a bit of a dirty word in our industry um, from a trainer point of view. Um, but when we talk about it and try and explain it, we can come across as quite patronising and probably put our methods across as wrong and put people off using us. Um, so hopefully in the next couple of minutes I'm going to explain it without coming across as patronising to you. So I'm going to use a bit of an example. Um, say you're new to training in your first six months to a year, you get very, very lean, which is what you need to do to look toned. Um, my, all of us or most of us are just carrying too much body fat to look toned at the end of it. So. Imagine in the first six months to 12 months, you get very, very lean. You probably don't have the physique you hoped you would. Um, it's probably lacking a bit of shape. It's not got that tone you was hoping for. So you go away for the next year, lift some weights, you train, put a bit of weight on because that's what happens. And then it, after that second year, you get very, very lean again. You look a bit more shapely. Um, the shoulders are more toned, the arms are more toned, you know, the bum's a bit rounder. So imagine that process over two, three, four, five years. At the end of that fifth year, again, you get very, very lean. The shoulders are more toned, the abs are coming through more, um, the bum's even rounder, it's higher. What's happened in that five years? You've basically built muscle. Whether you like it or not, you've not toned anything. The muscle has got bigger and it's creating that more shape. And then from a body fat point of view, you've got very lean again. And then all that's happening is um, it's exposing that larger muscle. So when we're talking about building muscle, at no point are we talking about bodybuilding. It's completely separate. They're freaks. They, they devote their life to it. The ones you see in the magazines, the proper bodybuilders, they're all on steroids. So you can, you're not even comparing apples and oranges. You're comparing apples and a chicken sandwich. It's, it's a completely different ball game. So it's a bit like doing a couple of boxing sessions a week and thinking you're gonna look like Anthony Joshua or going for a swim with your friend two or three times a week and thinking you're gonna look like Matt Michael Phelps. In your head, it's never gonna happen, but the minute we talk about building muscle and lifting weights, people suddenly think bodybuilding and you just need to get it out of your head completely. So if you are wanting to build a physique, get a bit more shape, get a bit more tone, concentrate on building a bit of muscle and all that is is getting stronger at the movements you're doing so if you, if for the last 10 years you've been doing body weight squats because you don't want bigger legs all you've done in the last 10 years is get good at doing body weight squats it's turned into cardio more than anything you're not toning anything you're not putting any strain or um, stimulus through the muscle so the, just think the exercise you're doing now, how can you make it harder? How can you add resistance? And then over the years, keep adding more resistance, keep bringing the body fat down, do that in cycles, and over a long period, you'll have that tone physique you're hoping for. So I hope that helps. Um, some of you will probably still be put off by lifting weights. That's completely fair enough. Um, go about your business as you wish, but hopefully it's helped some of you. See you later.